week or there's a trunk show, um, an Indian Tangle trunk show happening this weekend, so I cannot wait to check it out. followed me home and I did pick up some new needles as you know like my new addiction is high high sharps and I when I cast on my trechia hat I cast on using some Knit Picks circulars and Knit Picks circulars are fine they're fine for like knitting socks and stuff that doesn't require cabling but you know this was the needles on here are not the sharpest. I don't know if you can see that. These right here are the Knit Picks and these right here are the High Highs. So you can see. I mean, it doesn't look like a huge difference, but believe me, it makes a huge difference when I'm knitting cables versus not knitting cables on these. So I swapped out the needles and it's like butter. It's awesome. They were having a trunk show at Woolen. It was the Indian Tangle trunk show. They had one on Thanksgiving weekend, but then they had another one this weekend. And I could not help, with the help of Rachel, who owns the store, she didn't really have to try too hard to convince me, but this caught my eye, no surprise. It's, um, what is it? Lakes Yarn and Fiber, and the fiber content is 60% Superwash Merino, 20% Yak, 20% Silk, 400 yards. And then as soon as I picked it up, Rachel's like, yeah, I really want to knit like a sweater out of that. And it got in my head and I was like, I'm just getting whole sweater quantities worth. So I got three, three skeins of this gorgeous, gorgeous yarn. It's 400 yards, so that's uh, 1,200 yards total. There's a sweater pattern or a cardigan pattern in my queue that I'm totally blanking on the name. Maybe I'll insert a photo of it here, but I think I have to cast it on because it's that's what comes to mind when I look at it. So yeah, that will be a project that I cast on in the near future. But anyway, aside from the yarn, I should also mention that I hung out with uh, Denise from Yoshi and Lucy Yarns. Uh, she also has a podcast, and Tanya, who I haven't seen in a super long time. She has the Knitting Spring podcast. I don't think she podcasted in a while, but it was really good to see her. Hi, Tanya. I don't know if you're watching. Um, and my cat is outside. I should probably get going, but it was an awesome, awesome day. Um, we ordered an Indian, so that should be here in a minute. So I should probably get going, and I feel totally awkward podcasting right now because Dennis is home and it's I get it's so awkward it's weird anyway I'm gonna go eat and see you guys tomorrow <laughs> bye